The conference here this week is for university educators from all across Australia. We have um, professional geologists as well as students and so it's an opportunity for us to all get together and talk about teaching and learning in geology. This year we've covered topics that range from work integrated learning through to how we can educate the general public about geology and then we've had specific examples of how people are doing best practice in education and learning in the classroom. We're demonstrating in a fairly innovative way how deformation of layered materials occurs and this simulates what happens in sedimentary basins when we have tectonic plates colliding together and so what students get to see is how deformation nucleates in one area, faults and folds grow, then they become inactive uh, due to the change in stress state and the deformation propagates with time through the sandbox. So it allows students to see in the matter of a few minutes what might take in the Earth maybe a million or ten million years. In a textbook they might just see a picture of the end result of deformation of the Earth's crust. Here they're actually seeing it from the underformed state like a movie essentially going through to the end state. So they're seeing a total replay of how the deformation occurred. I guess the thing is they get very excited and get very engaged in the learning. So if you're in the lab you hear a lot of noise as the students are excited, they're getting measurements done. Some students will film it, we take the film away and they then analyse it, they do lots of quantitative analysis, they learn a lot of mechanics. So it's not just about entertaining them with moving objects, it's actually deepening their understanding of mechanics.